What the hell is that? That's the new distress caller. <laughs> Dango, I swear to God, I thought you were making that note. Works out Ooh, most too. He's bringing <laughs> stuff in. Wait, wait, wait. Look dead at. Look dead into my eyes, and then do it again. That's by far the worst one. <laughs> Are there any weapons? Uh, there's no new weapon. Right, first thing I'm gonna test is the ATVs. Give me my green one. Okay. We need to go into the garage. Garage? Nope. Busted. Oh, got the lag spike. Oh, yeah. Oh, that is so much nicer, isn't it? Amazing, that's beautiful. Wait, does this thing still work when you go like that? Oh. Wait, they might have patched that in the last update. Wait, go on. Oh, I think they did. I think they <laughs> patched it. <laughs> nope, they didn't patch it. There's a blind here too, do you have this? Uh, no. I don't know how blinds work though, because I think if one person has them unlocked, they don't unlock all the way, but I should give it a test. Wait, actually, no, we don't. <laughs> you okay? Uh. <laughs> what the fuck have you done to me, Teko? <laughs> What did you do? <laughs> Taco, you broke my neck. <laughs> Can you see my character? <laughs> Can you see the stand in there? <laughs> For everybody at home right now, this isn't a trick of the eye with any editing. This is legit. Taco has just broke my neck. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> like, if you... Taco... I'm, I'm no joke. It's a good job that I can turn my screen to the side and look and like view it in um, like turn it horizontally straight to vertical. Otherwise, there's no way I could do this. Well, I think I think I'm going to have to relug. My head's on literally on sideways. <laughs> Try getting on the see if you can get on your uh, quad. See if that fixes it. Did I did I like do barrel rolls and shit? Because yeah. that's what it looked like. Yeah. 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 <laughs> see if that fixes it first. Oh, wait, wait. Yeah, we're, we're back. I think. Right. Wait, kind of. No, not not really back. One second. Okay, let's level out and then let's get off this time. Okay, I think we're good. I don't know if it's just because I've just had the feeling of like the most extreme neck break of my life. <laughs> Still <laughs> Was... concussed a little bit. Uh, so did this appear for you too? Mm, this did appear. But I've got to build it too. Okay. How does that make any sense? Well, I was able to build it and we're under <gasps> your save. So Wait, that's... whoa, whoa, whoa. Something hurt me then. So wait, if I build this one now, does that mean it's going to be two? No. It just means I think you can open it up for you as well. And...
build. Okay, so... But are you going to be in this with me? Take a look. Nope, capacity reached, it said. Oh, okay. In there at a time. So then surely then one person should be able to buy it for the two of you playing, if only one person can fit in. Right. Make some changes to that. I don't know. Then... It's it's good that they've they've done that now. At least it like it, you know it's another reason to to play the multiplayer because you can unlock the stuff. But I mean, let's say for example, if I was new to the game and you had all the credits in the world and you wanted to show me cool stuff you could buy, I really couldn't use it because I still got to unlock it anyway. So it's still kind of the same. Right, onward. Try not to kill me this time, Taco. <laughs> As you shoot. Oh my god. What? My quad. <laughs> Nothing wrong with it. <laughs> Wait, did that? Oh, I thought I damaged the quad. Yeah, a little bit. Not much. Oh, I did? Oh, you can do that? Yeah, a little bit. Knocked it down probably about, I don't know, one, one six. Well, after the 17 barrel rolls I did, mine, mine's got quite a substantial amount of, of uh, damage. Somebody did say to me in the previous uh, video that I should check these just in case there's like, you know, anything that says attention or, or warning Bigfoot spotted in the area, something like that. Oh, yeah. Oh, wait. There's, please read. There's something that's been removed from behind you. Doo -doo -doo -doo. You see the marks? Oh, yep, yep. Right, Taco, face me. We're going to give you a test. Let's see your knowledge of, of, a, uh, of a forest, okay? This is the forest fire hazard rating test. <laughs> what color is extreme? I would say red. Okay, that's one out of one. What color is medium? Orange. Ooh. First hurdle. You want to go for a second answer? Yellow. Nice. What color is high? Orange. What color is low? Blue. You absolute phony. You don't you've never been hunting before. You made that up. It's green. How could you not know that, Taco? Everybody knows that. I <laughs> know. Oh, I'm just gunning this. Oh. I held my breath for like half a second then because I was just going through those. What what, what are those called? I actually I wanted to know that from the last episode. What's right. that? Ah, it didn't work. Oh wait, I'm, st I'm my head's still on sideways. <laughs> I'm not even joking. There's no lean in this game, but it looks like I'm leaning left. A little bit. No, you look. I have. To me. I have serious injuries, Taco from earlier. I think uh, my spine needs recorrecting. Yeah, you want to relog? Or we get up to the next save? No, no, I mean, I mean, it's okay. I can keep correcting it. It's just every now and again, my uh, my character's body forgets how, it, how it's supposed to be. Who's and then I'm, I'm just like drooping to the side. <laughs> so you're asking what, what what's what called? Yeah, what are these things called? Are they cat? It's not cat's tails, are they? They're not these ones cattails uh i mean they could be but they're just there's no, nothing growing on them right now but the reeds but you know i'd generally call them just reeds i thought they had yeah. like a specific name i i don't have no idea to be honest i mean somebody in chat would probably say taco what kind of hunter are you if you do not know what kind of grass this Remember is when we, were, we were trying to figure out the the flower that like yeah, it was a it was a dandelion, wasn't it? Dandelion, yeah. That's why I was saying daddy long legs because yep. I had it in my head. I know. I was in the same, you know, sound. <laughs> I just can't couldn't get it in my head. That's the bitch about recording, like, and then saying something just on the fly. You you, it's so simple when you're not recording, but when yep. like when you are, for some reason, everything becomes so much more of a ch like just words in general. Like you've heard me a million times try and say the most simple of things, like ATV. I'll call it like a BFG or something like that. I'm just where the f <laughs> that, where did that come from? Is this what happens?
So, for those of you guys that haven't really worked out what's changed in the Hunter, basically, when me and Taco used to play, and if he played on my game that I invited him to, he could never get or unlock any of the green that you can see on the map. So, it would be me going to a certain outpost or a certain lookout, unlocking it, but he couldn't get it. He couldn't unlock the outpost. Since, I think it's update, is it 1.10, Taco? Is that the new update? Uh, Pretty sure it is that one. Um, but since the latest update, yes, they've yes. now enabled that. So in multiplayer, you and your friends can unlock the same stuff. So just for like the last 20 minutes or so, we've just been testing stuff. Like certain things like being able to see feed zones or, or anything like that to see if it stays on Taco's map. Because again, I'm hosting this game. And so far, so good. We're able to claim the same points. What are you doing? You literally like he's like somebody put the rocks around your body while you were laying flat. Yeah. Wait, there's stuff all around us. There was a deer over there. I don't I think it was a male too. Apparently it brings deer in as well. Oh wait, I see it. All right, I'm going for the shot. It is a male. Wait, did I get it? Yeah, I got it. Kill nice. shot. All right, let's go take a look. Yeah, that thing definitely brought that in, though, because he was walking straight towards us, and then as soon as he stopped, he just carried on walking in a straight line. <clears throat> but yeah, it's for a dare. Or dare. For bear. Is it for a dare? You doing it for a dare, Taco? For, for a dare, yes. <laughs> but that again, that goes back to what we were saying before. Sometimes when we're recording, weird shit happens. Like, your brain says one thing. I mean, you want to say, like I've just done, you want to say one thing, but your brain says the other. Oh, right, right. right. Like the coyote. I freaking call it a fox and then a wolf. <laughs> there are no wolves. <laughs> yeah, what did you say? A, wolf. a fox, wolf, coyote, the, the new yeah, hybrid. Fox, wolf, coyote. Yes, <laughs> it's a hybrid. Doesn't look too special, looks like a normal one. He is a male, 64 kilograms, fur type, super, super rare. Super, super rare. <laughs> Difficult. I know, I couldn't think on the spot of like what the rarest one would be. I just wanted you to go, really? All right, we got it. Right on the other side of the trail here. Well, there's one coming. Yeah, might roll up over this ridge. She's walking from left to right, so she's directly in front of me. Yeah, I, I hear her. You can just hear the pitter-patter of, of hooves every now and again, and then it stops. Oh, wait, there she is. Nice shot. Bar. There's no way that she's going to be moving for long. I hit it with the 7mm. See, that distress call is supposed to be a downed here, so maybe that's just, there she's just coming to investigate. So yeah, like they're curious. Out. She had a med kit on her, so <laughs> to help. If you guys are wondering what we're doing right now, we're actually on a nighttime hunt. It's been a while since we've done this. And uh, we've decided to give ourselves a bit of a challenge. Right now, I've got a lever action. Taco's got a lever action. I think Taco's is only slightly more powerful than mine. He's uh, He's got a scope on his as well, which is what I'm trying to save up for. Because these things look so cool when they've got scopes on them. Yeah, this uh, scope is really neat looking. It has wait, wait, wait. Uh... One second, Taco. Is that you moving? Nope. Oh, I thought something was coming down towards us. Sorry, Gwen. I was just saying the scope is cool looking too. It, it matches the old school look. It has that uh, dirty tinge to it. It's not shiny by any means. Wait, let me see the scope. Does it, is it all scratched up? Because on the picture that when I wanted to buy it then, it was all scratched up. It's not scratched up. It looks like, you know, like over time with fingerprints and stuff like that, the oils from your fingers had, you know, gotten to it. So it's got that aged look to it. Neither have I, I mean. Male. I'm going to call it in. Um, I'm... Well, there's no cover here, really, is there, apart from this tree? 
Fuck it, we've got the high ground. As I say, we have high, we can also lay down, it's pretty flat land. We can get up to like a spot where we can lay down. Was that male too? It was, wasn't it? Yep. They usually travel in packs of two or three. Like raptors? Just like raptors. I'm trying to... Wait, let me find a spot where I can... Oh no, it's moving away. I wonder if that, you know, that god lake that we used to go to where there was just like hundreds of animals, I wonder if that's still working. You know what I mean, uh, in the yeah. game? Yeah, yeah. Because we could show people um, at home that place if like, if people are struggling to find like any uh, any kills. game. Yeah, just get some kills down. Yeah, there's a new outpost just south of there. Oh, there is? Oh yeah, you're right. You calling him in? I put some spray out too. Right, let's see if we can get a Whitlock kill or a lever action kill. So they travel in twos and threes, so we should hopefully be able to bring in a couple of them, Bill Pick. That sound is terrifying. Oh, it's an it elk. Okay, I see it. I, I see, see it. one too, I see one. Is Are you looking at the one which is just before the east on the yep. Um, compass? Yep, there's two of them there. There's definitely two of them oh, right yeah, there. Oh, yeah, I see them too. Right, well, what's the what's the safest bet here? Is it both of us trying to get good shots on one? I say we both pick one, and we'll get them closer. There's, there's a third one coming in now. This this potentially could be a stampede. Yep, there's three of them. Oh, there's a big one. The one closest to us is 837 to 970. One in the back is the smallest one so far. 837. So the two front ones are the two bigger ones. The one in the back is the weak. There's a th our fourth one way back there. 970 to 1102. Ooh, that's a big one. Where's that one? Way in the back. Golden right. I'll tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going prone. I'm going prone. Keep calling them in. Because I've got a feeling they can see me here. They He, he stood up. And then he kind of did a small turnaround, but like not running away. Well, okay, they're getting really close. They're getting really close. Sorry, just stay laid down. Or if you're standing next to the tree, you should be able to stay hidden pretty well. I want that back one. Tell me when they're close enough to take a shot. I'm going to go for the second one, I think. Shouldn't spot you just yet, I wouldn't think. As long as your visibility is a flat line. Going up to crouch. Did you see that behavior, the way they moved away as soon as I stood up? I've got, I've not got the flat yep. line, I've got the, um... Half moon below the line? Yeah, yeah. One looks like it's... Back? No. You got a shot, go ahead, take it. Here's the third, another one coming in. It's two. I did have a shot, and then he just he turned around. This uh, closest one, eight thirty-seven, nine seventy. Both of these are the two eight thirty-sevens. Yeah, a lot of times I'll just jump on a boulder and lay down on it. It's Sixty. Oh, that's a mating call. Yep. Looking for love. All the wrong places. Yep. You know, since the previous episode when um, we were talking about Predator and aliens and stuff, I swear to you, Taco, the more things I hear in this game now are just sounding more and more like aliens and Predator because <laughs> there's... Have you heard that bird that, that makes the uh, the noise like the tracker does from aliens? Uh -huh. I, I'm constantly hearing it now. And I'm trying my best not to say anything, but I'm hearing it all the time. People at home watching the video... If you can hear that, let me know in the comments. I know I've said it before, but I just can't get it out of my head now. We need like a we need to talk about different mods for the game, like a Jason, a Jason Voorhees mod. Do you imagine that? Oh. Yep. He's just trying to survive. <laughs> He's just going around. Oh man. I mean look especially like right now, look at how foggy it is. The this fog that settled over the ground. It's the amazing. They did an awesome job. Yeah, then yeah, then all of a sudden you hear that.
I can see him, but I've not got a clear shot. I'm going for it though. So, so right first here. chance I get. Oh, he's just stopped right behind the tree. Don't run. Every single time I'm about to take the shot. No! Right, there's the male. He keeps going behind the tree. Here we go. I hit the... How did that hit the rock? Oh, I'm pissed. I'm a failure, Taco. <laughs> the blood. Trampled Forgot how cool right? that looks with the head, the uh, the the head torch. Mm -hmm. You already have a huge advantage. Uh, There's something the right in front of us. I think it's a coyote as well. Oh, no, there he is. Okay, I see it. Right, I'm taking this shot, Taco. I've got an itchy trigger finger right. right now. I can hear it. I can it, hear it's, it. I he's coming towards it. you. He's coming towards you. Yep. I saw I saw something move, but go ahead and take it. Wait, I don't have a shot. I think I hit it? Oh, there was two. All right, we got something, at least. Yeah, something looked um, like a coyote came running across from right to left towards where I just hit that thing. Right, there we go. We got a little bit of blood. Flesh wound. So, seeing as though this deer is literally making me run back and forward through this part of the forest, I wanted to address a question that I recently got on a video, which was when am I going to be playing Bigfoot again? The, uh, the Finding Bigfoot game, which is now just called Bigfoot. Um, if you didn't know, that game was going through a huge update, and the devs did announce recently, if you go to their uh, Steam page, that they've made some huge changes to maps too, so we're definitely going to be playing it again, we're just waiting for the devs to release the new update, but yeah, we're definitely going to be playing that game again, and we're going to terrify Taco with the new changes. I'm looking forward to it, I, it's one of those games, I'm not a fan of scary games, but playing with somebody, I can do. No it's way a very cool game, game isn't it? Up. Like fundamentally what they had in that game was really cool like just alone in the woods there's a bigfoot running around if you guys yeah. didn't know i'm going to spoil a few things about what they've got in the update i'm guessing most of you guys know anyway but they uh, they recently implemented drones so uh, you can you can go and fly them through the actual woods looking for maybe tracks or signs of the bigfoot or even the bigfoot himself so we're definitely going to be playing that game. Taco, you can definitely be the pilot of the drone. I've, I've completely lost this track. So turns out trying to hunt that deer wasn't as successful as I thought it would be. The thing just kept leading me straight down the side of the map and it wasn't losing blood or anything like that. So in the end, we just decided to call it quits. We were trying to chase, well, at least I was trying to chase that thing for a good coming on to 20 minutes. And I was so far away from Taco and we wanted to take a look at the Hirschfelden map, so that's where we are now. So, uh, Taco's got a change of clothes. We're still rocking the uh, lever action rifles. Wait. Now we're both rocking the lever action rifles. And I think what we're going to do is just take a look around the map because there's quite a few things that you can see is green on this map. So, we're going to see what we can find. Hopefully, we're going to come across some pigs because it's been a while since we've hunted any pigs. And as bad as it's going to be for Taco to take down a relative of Doris, it's got to be done. You know the edge I just fell off? Go full pace off it and you'll make it. <laughs> Easy peasy. Did you stick it? Yeah. Nice. Oh, I'm stuck at the Oh rock. my god. <laughs> <laughs> oh no. I'm stuck. 
I'm wedged in here, I can't get out. Oh, 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 oh! I'm coming back, I'm going to try the other weird glitch thing. <laughs> I can't get round here. Maybe that? Oh, I did it! I did it. <laughs> nice! Are you stuck? No, I'm good, I'm good. I'm just at a weird angle. The glitch comes in handy. <laughs> in fact, let's let's show people that real quick, because that might help somebody out. Like so for the longest time, well, ever since they introduced the ATVs into the Hunter Call of the Wild. When me, Taco, and Proto are all playing together, there's this really weird glitch where if one person gets off their ATV next to yours, whether you're on it or not, it, it kind of fires the ATV into like 50 to 1,000 yards away. So, you ready, Taco? Wait, sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. You've got to kind of like, you, you sit on yours a second. And then you just very quickly press E, and then it should just... You see how it kind of made him wiggle like that? But normally it fires them off into the distance. I think I showed you guys on the, on one of the outtakes of the videos. Oh, well, you oh, what you have you fight. done, Taco? <laughs> <laughs> My poor ATV. Oh, I'm on you, Taco. Oh, I'm so on you right now. This. Going for the inside yeah. line. He goes for the inside line. He takes it. Oh, it's a beautiful move. <laughs> all we ever do, the people at home never see this, but all we ever do when we're on the quads is just fight each other, try, try and. Uh, what was that game called? Is it Road Rash? Do you remember Road that? Rash, yeah. When you used to like de beat the crap out of each other. Yeah, it was such a good game. <laughs> Whoa, you just, when you got on there, that's me. Huh? I was, sta I was standing on your quad, and when I jumped on to sit down, it threw me way back. Wait, 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 you do it? Wait. You just don't have the agility la of, of that I do, Taco. Wait. That what it is. <laughs> I can't. Right. I can't even get on this now. It's too slippy. Still. Oh, there we go. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> See, we're supposed to be showing people the updates, like how how pretty much everything. I mean, near enough everything is in sync, where people can pick up stuff, you can claim places, you can find laws and like the question marks around them. All we've done for like the last 45 minutes is mess around with glitches in the game. Of course. Glitches are fun. Yeah, that was a tricky one. I, thought, I was wondering what it was going to be next. There we go. Look out! Oh! You just threw me off! Oh my <laughs> god! <laughs> oh no! <laughs> do you know, that was the one time I didn't intentionally do it either. <laughs> because when we were arriving at the uh, the lookout, I was like, wait a second, why is my ATV's um, engine? Like, why can't I hear the engine? So I got off it and back on it again, and then all the head was you go home. <laughs> and then I just saw a quad. <laughs> Red Fox. Is it? Yep. The Ooh, hell is that? Heard, uh, we are in bison territory. That was a bison? Yep. I've never heard that noise before. For sure it was a bison. Um, That's not a bison. That is a... Is that a red deer? Was it? You know what? I'm just going to use a higher caliber one just for this one because... Oh, yeah. I guess it could be. Yeah. Oh, no. Oh, if I see it. Oh. 
Well, I could call like I got a lure. I, can, I sent it in, and I was gonna take oh, that boy. shot. Eight. I'm gonna get into this tree. In right, in front of them. right, we'll go for the lever action. Nice. Try to get a couple of shots on it. God, I love that reload animation for this weapon. Yeah, where the feed in on the side. Yeah, it's so cool. Very cool. I know roughly the area where it's making the calls from. I just can't. I see it. I think I got it. That scent eliminator that you use is so good. Okay, gender, female, weight, 9.23 kilograms, fur type common. Okay, it wasn't actually that much. I only got 670 for that, and that was a, uh, a spine shot too. Oh, I know why. It's because it was with the uh, 270. Oh, oh, there we go, 0 to 25, and I see the body of this. Right, can you see... Um, towards... Well, I'm just taking the shot. Yeah, take it. Oh, I, th I think I whiffed. I wanted to go for a headshot, just try and get it down straight away, but... Yeah, I think I whiffed. I don't see it. Does it did it run? Yep. Just give it a... Okay. I didn't see any flinch from it either. Okay, so what was this one again? Was this the red deer with the? Uh, yep. This was the lever action kill, wasn't it? Yep. There it is. Face in the mud. He was a male, weight 196.12 kilograms. Fur type common, tracking distance, uh, difficulties medium, trophy type is antlers. Okay, that was a pretty good uh, pull in terms of cash. 1,196, 143 XP. First shot was 4%. It's a good job that I got that second shot off because that was the left lung 95% hit. I love the way it does that. Like, it shows what position the animal was into when you hit it. Mm -hmm. Oh, I see. Out top of the hill. Give me rough coordinates. The red deer. Um, see the clearing, like, uh, going up the hill. You see the mountain in the far... I, far, see far I see it. I see it. I see it. I see it. Okay, so the target is exactly 279 meters away. I want a vital hit, Taco, or a headshot. You take your pick. Vital hit with a weapon that hardly any use. any of thin of your choice. You don't have to use lever action because that's quite a far shot. 280 meters, we'll call it. Fire when ready. Nice hit, nice hit. I think it's about to go down. You going to go down? Oh, it thought about it and then. Drop. Yep. Oh wait, no, Warfare. no. Yep, it's this. Right. There we there go. Goes. There we go. <laughs> nice, quick, clean kill. Nice shot. This this rabbit yep. has been around me for like. Come here, rabbit. Let me see if I can kill it. So remember that game that we were gonna play, Sniper Elite. Mhm. Mm I was, uh, I was thinking about playing it again the other day, and then I thought, like, in, in this game, how cool would that be if you took a shot and you could actually see the trajectory of... Can rabbit's back! <laughs> <laughs> Fuck you, rabbit! Fuck you! Oh, I got it! Oh, he killed it! <laughs> this thing has been tormenting me for like 20 minutes since we came right down the side of that hill. He's just been following us all the way around. Um, so we deserved it. That's, that's my point. I got, a, I got a screenshot of you and your uh, trophy. <laughs> of the rabbit. <laughs> of the rabbit. Nobody has to know about this, Taco. <laughs> Nobody has to know about the rabbit kill. All right. You you, you called out. Uh, so go ahead and take, take a look at it. No, no, you I go got. for it. You go for it. You got the kill. It was a 280 yard, uh, 280 meter shot. No, no, That's no. I, I already have enough. Go ahead. Take, I mean, either way, I'm gonna get the XP for it and stuff. So go ahead, take it. Okay. Want to know? Okay, so it was a female red deer, 157.82 kilograms. Um, 
Where does it show the distance? Oh, there we go. Yeah, so 280 meters. Well, it says 277, but it's 280. Uh, that's a hell of a shot. A left lung as well. You got a vital hit. Oh, you make... I know why you wanted me to do that, because you knew. You knew that was a clean shot, and you wanted me to show everyone at home. <laughs> no, GG. Real good shot. Deer up ahead, running through. The moose. And oh my goodness, there's deer everywhere. Definitely in the right place. Oh, a moose just, a moose just cut in between my UR ATV. That was so cool. Are we ditching, we're ditching him? Okay guys, so we have pretty much arrived at the place that I was talking about throughout the entire video. If you want to try and get some kills, maybe practice your aim, or maybe you need to get a certain animal because you've killed everything else, this is actually a really good spot. I think, how long ago did you discover this taco? It was like really early on, wasn't it, when we were first playing it? Yeah, yeah, it was something I came across just walking the perimeter of the map. Yeah, it was quite some time ago, but if you want to know on the map whereabouts it is, if I zoom right out, we are in Leighton Lake. If you go to the bottom left-hand side, there are actually two spots where you can uh, fast travel to. It can be this one here, the Runiki Western Outpost, or this, the normal Runiki, Runiki Outpost, which is more towards the center of the map. Uh, we've used the ATVs to get here, but it's this lake that you want. And just on this side here is where we're going to see the animals. So let me show you guys what we're talking about. Now, this could make me look really stupid because there's recently been, obviously, the update. And obviously, things change with the update. But if me or Taco or any of the guys want to try and get some kills, this is generally where we come. As you can probably there's tell from the purple. There's a few elk over there on the other side. But a few elk over there. So. Yep. We'll go up along this package here. I can use my new collar then. We're right at their their despawn point, so there is one thing I did want to tell everyone at home, Taco, if they did want if they did want to do this. Um, what's that glitch where if you shoot so many animals um, or down so many animals in an area, what happens? Oh yeah, they start. They don't despawn, but they they tend to start running in place if you take down too many animals at once without claiming them and getting rid of, rid of the bodies. That's it. That's the uh, one. Yeah. Yeah. yeah yep. And they were, it was like desyncing the animals. So just be aware of that, guys. Like, I mean, this is a really black good spot. Like, look at this. We've got male, male black tail over there. Pretty easy shot to make, too. I mean, you just got to wait, be patient a little bit. Wait for the, uh, the animal to show as much of the side as possible. What's that one? We've got another one, white tail. But this area yeah, is just female. full, full of them. The best place that There's down moose there, across. you can see, that's a huge moose. Some deer. We've got some up there, too. This area here is normally full of animals, so let's get a little bit closer. Let's see what we can see. Do you see the uh, the male moose across the uh, the other side, like halfway? He's in. The, he's right next to a male deer too. Um, halfway up the lake, just to the left of a giant rock. A milly rock? No. There's like there's like a big gap, and then to the left there's the rock, yep, and then yep, I see okay. It, I see it. Right. Going for the moose. Yep. On go. Three, two, one, go. That's down. Right. Nice. So the moose went down straight away. Don't think we spooked that deer. Okay, we've got a male moose. And a male deer there, by the looks of it. A little exploratory. Oh, there we go. Flesh and jaw. Did you drop any around here? No, nothing over there. All on the scent. But I think you guys get the point. This area is actually really, really good. Especially if you want to just practice getting your shots down. If you got a new rifle or something. That's a female black-tailed deer. I want to go for the moose. But once again, guys, if you want to know where it is on the map, it's right here, bottom left-hand side of Leighton Lake. 
Okay, so have you have you glitched out now? So just to show you guys exactly what can happen is if you stay in one area too long and you bring down too many animals, this is what you'll find. The animals will just be running or walking on the spot. Now, sometimes you are able yeah. to shoot them and sometimes you will be able to collect the trophy too. But more often than not, this is completely glitched. Like, headshot, try and put it down in one. Try again. I mean, it's just not going to go down. Point blank shot from there with a the magnum. Just isn't going down. But you will see this too, like the blood. But that's what you want to be careful of. If you overhunt in an area, then this glitch will happen. It's It's been one of those things for the hunter for the longest time. But this is the female that I was hunting. She actually gave me quite a long runaway. What is it you're hunting, Taco? Uh, either black tail or white tail. I'm not 100% sure, but the blood is endless. <laughs> Yeah, so it's doing it's doing what it did to me before too. Yeah, yeah, it's been zero to twenty-five for quite a while, and it's just endless blood. It's every couple steps is blood. I wonder if that's something from the update. Maybe it's a glitch, or maybe it's like a, a new way of having to track the animal. I know you can change the color of the highlighted animal tracks. Oh yeah, actually, I, I forgot you could do that. If you go to your settings in game. In active track, you can change from white to a different color. So let's put that to red. Uh, active track. Instead of cyan, we'll go with... Uh, is there a purple? There is no purple? Oh, there we go. Okay. Magenta. Ele electric violet taco. Collectible outline color. Let's leave that as a... Let's leave that as a lime. So if we go off this now, and then we try and find a track. Oh, look at that. That's really cool. It's a nice change. And then if we want to track it, it changes to purple, and that's the direction we want to go in. But, guys, I think this is where we're going to end for today. Thank you very much for joining me once again, Taco. Absolutely. If you guys enjoyed the video, drop a like below. Thank you so much for watching, and we'll see you all in the next one.